I'm Stu Miniman with theCUBE, joined here by Ed Palmer, who's the COO of Winslow Technology Group. We're at their Dell EMC user group. Ed, thanks so much for joining me. Thank you. All right, uh, so Ed, we, we talked to Scott earlier, and Scott gave us a lot on the history uh, of the company. You recently joined Winslow Technology Group, but you have history uh, with, with, with Scott. So tell us a little bit about your background and what brought you over to WTG. Sure, so as Scott may have told you, we worked together earlier in our career, and I was a system engineer. He was the account exec. We worked very effectively together, and we have reunited later in our careers. All right, and tell us a little bit about your role as the COO. You were an SE, I believe that's part of uh, what you have in, in, in the org. Yes, so the way we've defined my role, I have responsibility for sales operations, for professional services, solutions architecture, and marketing. All right, so luckily things aren't changing that much uh, in the industry at all. Um, wait, you know, the, the companies you're working with, they haven't all been acquired uh, since you came <laughs> on board, right? Uh, so what, what, is, what is this, the, the pace of change and kind of the, the, the breadth and depth of what's happening in the industry, how does that impact your organization? Great question. So obviously the industry is changing all the time. It's a very dynamic industry. And obviously that has an impact on our operational effectiveness. So one of the things I'm interested in is how do we streamline operations? How do we work more effectively with our partners? How do we fully maximize the partner programs and fully leverage all of the incentives? Yeah, uh, gosh, I, I have to think, uh, we were talking to Jeremy Burton earlier and said, you know, you no longer do five-year planning, you maybe do two-year planning. Yes. Uh, and really it needs to be much more on a granular level. Um, every company you're dealing with, they have different financial years, their incentive plans change all the time. Yes. Um, you know, what's kind of the North Star for your team? How do they make sure they kind of have a steady, uh, you know, push on things, but, uh, you know, are flexible, can act with the changes that happen? Sure. So let me start by saying the Winslow team has experienced phenomenal growth over the past three to five years. And we're looking to continue and extend that growth over the next three to five years. What we do is we put together business plans and we put together plans by partner. And to your point, those plans are forward looking but they're also broken out by quarter. So we're actually quarterly driven and we drive our demand generation activities around those plants. All right, and Ed, talk about the, the skill set. How do you keep up with training uh, for, for the organization? It's a great question. So as a Dell EMC Titanium partner, it is quite a challenge to keep up with all of the training and certification requirements. We actually got a jump on it earlier this year and we've defined our entire training plan for the year. In fact, I would say we're about 80% complete with those plans. They do require a lot of time, but they're important to maintain titanium level. Yeah, so there's the requirements that you have from your partners, but then Winslow Technology Group usually is pretty early on a lot of technologies. Uh, Scott, in his opening remarks this morning, talked about you know compellent, hyper-converged, uh, hybrid cloud uh, yes. being some of the early edges. How, how, how does your organization play a part of that, and how, how do you kind of do the communication with uh, the, the field and the customers uh, to, to know not only what to jump on, but how to get your whole team uh, in, embracing and, and pushing those, those items? Sure, so what we like to say is we are, are not trying to be all things to all customers. And I would say we are differentiated with our approach. So what we look to do is define game-changing technologies. You may hear Scott talk about that. And what we look to do is provide deep expertise in those technologies. So that drives our training and certification plan. And we're looking to fully develop our pre-sales solution architects and post-sales professional services consultants to be experts in those technologies. All right. And Curious, Ed. You know, what's what's your hiring plan like? You know, where do you find good people? How do you, you know, maintain and you know keep 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 some great people? Sure. Most of it, quite frankly, is through word of mouth, through our employees. And I would say the majority of our employee base are through referrals. So that's typically how we're finding great people. All right. You, you, we've talked earlier about how you know there, there's no shortage of change going on there. Uh, what's exciting you about what's happening in the industry, and there anything that kind of you know concerns you about what, what's happening? Well, we talked about the dynamic nature of the industry and constant change. Yeah. I think what's really exciting is the whole move to hyperconverged. We're seeing a lot of interest in hyperconverged solutions. The move to cloud, obviously. We're seeing a lot of interest in point technologies like software-defined data center, software-defined networking. And I think what's exciting for us is working with our breadth of partners to really understand how those technologies and solutions address the business needs of our customers. All right. 
I want to give you the final word uh, as, as, you know, what, what were you hoping to gain when you come into this event? And uh, as, as you look at the customers, what are you hoping that they take away from this event? Sure. For me personally, this is my first Winslow Users Group event. I think it's phenomenal. And I think for our customers, it's an opportunity to be exposed to the technology, to ask questions of our subject matter experts, and I think come away from the, the event mm -hmm. thinking about how the technology can be implemented in their environment to maximize their business. Very well. Ed Palmer, uh, welcome to the, your, your first event. It's our first time here. Thank you so much for having us. We'll be back with more coverage here from the WTG Dell EMC user group. You're watching theCUBE.